Hello, welcome to the homestead. Here we are. It's beautiful. It's about 61 degrees and um, it's supposed to be 80 today. How lovely. We're only here for a few hours because it is a school day. We have our granddaughter with us because we homeschool on Wednesdays and we have to pick up our grandson from school um, at three o'clock. So we've only got a little bit, but we wanted to come out here because we did have a good rainstorm a few days back. And then yesterday we had a heavy windstorm and we wanted to see what happened. And these branches that are um, right here, I don't know which side to go on, but the branches that are right here, the, the broken branch, that was all right in our driveway and Lee had to drag them off to the side and um, nothing really fell on this side of the fence, which is a good thing, but on the road side of the fence, we did have some things that fell. And then I'm gonna take you over here to where our shed is and show you what happened over there. So what happened here was this big branch, well, the whole tree, which was a dead tree, fell and it landed right here, missing our shed. But you can see that there is a branch that is leaning up against our shed that also fell. So the fence is a little crushed here. We have an empty spot now where the tree's not standing. But uh, we looked at the rest of the fence line and it looks pretty good. Uh, but we are going to have to do something about these dead trees out here, especially since we haven't made our way in. And with the water and the mud and everything, we can't drive across this. So we are kind of stationed right here at the gate, which means the more of these branches that fall, and I can see there's some broken ones that are still up in the tree that will easily fall with a heavy wind. So we're going to have to do something about that but we do have all those trees that we purposely cut down, the huge stack of them, and we're gonna need to start cutting those up, sawing those down, and, um, and getting that moved out of here. And so that's what we're gonna do over the next couple of hours is just work on trees. work to do every time the wind blows or we have an ice storm <laughs> and trees come down so we've got some work clearing up over there and we're gonna have to be preemptive on this tree here so it doesn't come down on the truck or the car so if you can look up there you'll see a bunch of dead branches laying in the tree and this tree has not failed to drop branches every time there's a storm so I guess it's time to work on that Okay, since we're over here on this part of the yard, we keep passing by with the camera this uh, trailer that's got a tarp over something. And you can see the green buckets. The green buckets that are back there, we got a whole stack of them, $3 each. They're just used buckets that cattle farmers use for their cows and horses to lick some stuff out of and then they have all these buckets. So we bought all these buckets here for our garden that we're going to plant here pretty soon. We're gonna start doing the seeds and I'm gonna show you all that. We're not starting the seedlings here on the property. We're gonna start them over at our daughter's house where we stay because uh, we need to um, have those little seedlings grow for four to six weeks before planting them. But then we're going to bring all these buckets and we're gonna have our garden out here, but we're gonna have to build us a high tower. Anyway, I digress. I was talking about this trailer. 
underneath that tarp Lee bought me a lovely little gift and uh, to help me out with doing more laborious things and so if I can get Lee's assistance we're gonna uncover this Voila! It's a lawnmower that you ride on. Yay! But you can see a lot has been cleared and there's just you know uh, well there's several trees back there still but there's not as much left so we'll tackle this again on Friday on Friday the kids have a school holiday of some sort teachers institution who knows what it is so we'll have the grandson out here as well as the granddaughter of course the granddaughter doesn't have the same schedule so she'll be doing homeschool in the morning time and uh, so anyway, it's been a good day. It's beautiful weather. Tomorrow is gonna be like 41 degrees. So I'm not gonna be happy about tomorrow, but today is absolutely gorgeous out here. And uh, lovely breeze to cool us down when we get a little overheated. Anyway, thanks for watching. God bless you. Before you sign off, go ahead and um, like, subscribe, share. Um, I think Lee tells me that it's the like button that, that that lets everybody uh, know that eh, come see this. Yep. Anyhow, um, do what's in your heart. God bless you. We'll see you next time. <laughs>